Find a good partner. Working with Mark at the Roxy. You're phenomenal, and you're one of the reasons why I'm still working at the Roxy. And uh, by the time this comes out, who knows, I might have retired by that point. Easy, Tiger. Yeah, he won't let me talk about that. But um, I work a little bit, a couple nights a week, two, three nights a week if I'm in town. Um, but r literally, uh, I mean, I don't need to work anymore at, at the Roxy. I could just do the business because I'm so busy and do a lot of different things. But uh, you keep it exciting. It's fun to come to work again because you... You remind me of me when I was younger and uh, a different kind of crazier style. Um, it's interesting as, as you go, as you, as you go through your bartending career, that uh, every six months or a year, I've I found with me anyway, my style's changed and it's evolved and I'm doing different things and I'm doing them differently also. So um, it's phenomenal to have a partner who is just as, as passionate about it as I am uh, and has more fun and I just know we're going to have a great time together. So, um, and you don't always find that when, you're, uh, when you start to do flair. Um, a lot of times you're alone and you're doing stuff and you certainly have to learn that first, no question. But once you get to a certain level and you have a partner that you can actually work with it, who's an equal, it's, uh, it's phenomenal. Uh, the passing and the intricacies and just we, we're just tuned into each other and um, it's a real joy to, to work with an exceptional partner. Thank you. Wow. Um.